Hello guys, welcome to a, back to another codingbad.com tutorial. This time we will be doing array 2 exercise without 10. The question says, return a version of the given array where all the 10s have been removed. The remaining elements should shift left towards the start of the array as needed, and the empty spaces, I think it's supposed to say here, at, at the end of the array should be 0. So 1, 10, 10, 2 yields 1, 2, 0, 0. You may modify and return the given array or make a new array. So what this question is basically saying is remove all the tens. And for the number of tens that were in the original array, add um, the appropriate number of zeros at the end. So if we look at this first example here, we have 1, 10, 10, 2. So he, here, there are two tens here. So if you look at the result, we have one and two, which are the only non 10 values in the array. And we have two zeros at the end because there were two tens in the original array. Um, you also look at the second example. Uh, we have 10, 10, two tens here and a two here. So you put the two at the front and you put two zeros at the end. Finally, if you look at the third example, you have a single 10 at the way end. So you um, put all the non 10 values at the front and you put um, a single zero at the back because there was only one 10. So what we first want to do is we want to check for the number of non 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 10 values there are. Sorry, uh, what I meant to say was we want to put all the non 10 values in the array in the front of the array. So how can we do that? Well, we will be creating an integer variable called index, which we will set to zero. And we will also loop through the um, original array. So we have int i equals zero, i is less than the length of the original array, i plus plus. Now, if the number we are looking at is not 10, a non 10 value, then we set the number at the index equal to whatever number we're looking at. And then we want to increase the index appropriately, so we add 1 to index. So what this does is it takes all the non-10 values and it puts all of them at the left side of the leftmost side of the array. So now you have all the ones, uh, you have all the non 10 values at, on the left and all the tens at the right. So now what we want to do is we want to look at all the tens and change them all to zero. So int i equals index. Now typically we would set this as this value at zero. However, because we want to start from where the non 10 values end and where the 10 values start, we will use the integer index, which was again used for here. Um, and then we want to continue the for loop until the end of the array. And then we will set the number at that spot equal to zero. And then we will return this modified array. And you get all correct.